Orange County Registered Digital. Sawdust, enough to cover three acres of winding walkways as a way to prevent dust and mud from potentially harming the art at the Sawdust Festival. And it was actually the media that dubbed its name the Sawdust Art Festival. Even though there are over 200 artists every year, figuring out where they will go isn't a challenge. We actually literally draw out, you know, lottery numbers, so we fill the spots up until 200. Every year, artists are able to create a design for their booth that is all their own. And a lot of it's meant to be kind of, um, dark whimsy so you'll discover that there are statements politically and socially. His creations range from odd sculptures to painting with clay. One of Walter's favorites is this one. I like the statement that it makes. Up above you may be able to read oil or dyes. And just around the corner. My images pop out at you like holograms. I paint with fluorescent, the black light paint. Some of the art is a little more eclectic. I love the idea of freedom of flight. I use a lot of um, birds, hands, wings. The pieces that I make are one of a kind. But if you want something more familiar, perhaps this painting. That one took a couple of days. I did them in acrylics and, and then um, uh, I, I wanted to get the values right, so I, I did some oil painting over the top. It had to go in a couple of phases. Some artists even utilize material outside of the norm. We do sand sculpting uh, we, on location, go down, do the sand sculpture. We take food color with us and paint them with food color and then take the photos. The festival is open from 10 to 10 daily from June 28th to September 1st. Reporting from Laguna Beach, I'm Shannon McPherson for the OCregister.com. Orange County Registered Digital.